What's up, Creepers and Geekers? Chris, the Atari Creep. How is everyone doing today? Let's uh, throw some credits in here. We're trying to get 10,000. Um, we're playing a, a, a port of... Or it's, it's more of a hack of Galaxians called Part X. I don't know. I'll try to put as much information about it as I can in the description. And, of course, the title and all that crap. And if you want to seek out this ROM for your emulation purposes... And by all means, but the game itself isn't important. It's just kind of background, background fodder for you to look at while I'm, I'm yapping about this, that, and the other, doing the obligatory New Year, New Me. <laughs> but all seriousness, guys, Happy New Year! Uh, it's always nice when we make it through, we survive a year, and we're we're ready to bob and weave and punch through the next one, 2020. Probably going to be typical, as usual. I'm not going to sit here and be like, it's going to be the year of us and we're awesome. But um, I still think it's important to reflect on the past year and maybe brief on, not talk about it nauseam. Fuck. Fuck. I'm not going to get 10,000 this way. That's my goal if I haven't said it yet. And as you can see, I'm at 94.70. Um, but the, you know, to talk about, you know, as far as the channel's concerned, you know, where we're at, give thank yous, and that's mainly what it is, thank yous, and um, moving on. So, 2019, as far as it's concerned for the Atari Creeps channel, was an amazing year. It was a very, very, uh, I was blessed this year, between generosity and, and, and growth. Uh, I never expect this channel to grow, I don't do this channel to grow it. Not trying to become a YouTube celebrity or anything to the like, nor do I care to anyway. If it should happen by mistake, I might walk away. <laughs> Who knows? Uh, maybe I'll enjoy it. Maybe I'll get a big head like Pat the NES Punk and I'll be a prick. I don't know. But either way, guys, my channel in 2019 and possibly 2018 has grown significantly. I started this channel in, in, in 2013, December 2013. On an obligation that ended up not not having shit. Um, and it's just, it blows my mind how many people, whether you stumble upon this shit show by accident, or you're re recommended from another another creator, um, that's, that's, that's really important to me too. When someone else has the confidence in what you do, or the respect for what you do, to, to, to say, hey, this dude is alright, or this, 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 this lady is cool. Um, you're, you're putting your name on the line. You know what I mean? If I were to say, hey, this guy is awesome, and he starts talking like a ton of Rachel shit, well, that reflects on me, or, you know, whatever. I mean, he, he speaks of a political matter that you're against. Whatever. Basically, if you're recommended to a channel, and you go there, and you find something that's not to your liking, that more reflects on the recommendation than the channel itself. And I take that very seriously, so... For anyone who's recommended my channel, thank you. Thank you for coming by. And uh, that's really it. Here's to more. I almost have a thousand. And when we, when we hit a thousand, you know what's going to happen? <laughs> we're we're going to keep on as 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 previously previously noted. So we're just going to keep on keeping on. And and you know what? Maybe that's a good segue into. The future of this channel, because there's really not too much to talk about. And when it comes to this channel itself, I don't really have a plan. It's really about what feels good. If I feel like playing a game today, like this, I was, I was mid-game. And I said, you know what? I have a few minutes. There's no one else in the house. Why not, while I'm trying to break my high score, um, make this video? So... If it feels good, I'm going to do it. And I think we're going to continue that philosophy throughout 2020. Um, now, what I do has changed quite a bit. Um, I've leaned a little bit more towards the gameplay. And we did a lot of toys in 2020, uh, 2019. A lot of toys. And I plan to do more toys in the future. And we'll talk about those here in a few seconds as well. Um, but if I feel like playing a game today, that's what I'm going to do. If I feel like just sitting there talking to you about a topic... Or if something comes up, um, that, that, that's what's going to happen. And that's why this channel is so, <sighs> call it diverse, I call it a, uh, a dumpster fire as far as uh, 
regularity is concerned, and I, I'm not concerned with that. I don't care. Uh, but that's just that's moving forward. We're just going to keep on keeping on like we like we did yesterday. So this past year, I've gotten a lot more into the gameplay stuff, and that's mainly because of availability, really. Um, if you've been around this channel long enough, you know I was more of a sit and chat kind of guy. I would be in front of the camera yapping at you about something and hoping to interact with you. And that's, that's the whole purpose of why I stick around. As long as I have, to be honest with you. I didn't even want to do this channel, and I did it. And I keep doing it. Oh, damn it. Oh, you sneaky bugger. Oh, let me kill this guy. We'll finish my thought here. If I remember what I'm talking about. And I don't. <laughs> already um but no uh sit and chat kind of videos that was my that was my bread and butter bread and butter here yeah. uh but we've 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 ventured into a whole bunch of other things um starting with prop bills and my art stuff which slowed down this year which slowed down this year um is that gonna pick up i don't know i don't know i have plans i got a really big build i want to do and maybe i won't do so much the bills themselves Maybe I'll finish the bills and do, like, this is how I did it. Wow, I should have fucking died right there. Someone timestamp that for me so I can watch that over and over again. My pants at my ankles. Um, but as far as bills and stuff are concerned, I don't know. I don't know. I do know we are going to still continue with talking about toys. And that was another big thing that changed this past year. I got more into talking about toys. Um, well, that was a horrible run. And I still have some from 2018. I still need to talk about a couple of Christmas gifts and what have you. Um, but with the new uh, Masters of the Universe line coming out in fall, and of course there's more Toony Terrors coming out that I'm really excited about. Uh, there's a, a Nosferatu, a kind of Orlock coming out that's really cool. Uh, Ash Williams. He's a coming out. I can't wait to, to look at those and parade them in front of you and, and share my excitement. Uh, gameplay is going to stay the same. If I feel like playing a game and recording it and talking to you about it, then we're going to do that. Um, especially, again, when, when it comes to, say, like the Amico. Uh, the game is going to be fairly cheap, and that's right up, right up my alley. So if I could talk about something that's not old and tired and able to afford it, Guys, that's gonna that's gonna wake my ass right up. It's gonna make me a little more excited to wake up in the morning to make these videos. Because how many times can you watch someone play Castlevania or you know whatever? Um, I'm trying to think, what else? Oh shit, you know, so there. What else is fairly new to me this year? I, you know, I would like to get back in the discussion videos though. The sitting there and chat, I feel that my tone is completely different. I have a different speaking style um, that I actually prefer. And if I were to have been a fan of this channel, I would prefer that. That's just me anyway. I never understood the whole why would you want to watch someone play video games. But people like that. So, and you know what? I watch it too. Like, especially when the Friday the 13th game came out. There was a, <clears throat> there was a ton of videos that were being released in streams that I watched the fuck out of. And that's out of my mind too. So maybe I'm just maybe I'm just changing in general for the creator and a uh, uh, fan as well. So um, I thought about doing a guitar thing, the guitar creep. I actually contemplated on doing that as another channel, uh, but I'm gonna slow down. Now. I did start that second channel technically up there. Um, the haunted house playset. I do plan on, on doing more with that. Uh, maybe I will move all projects to that channel. So if you want to be a, you know, if you want to subscribe to that channel, that'd be cool. I'm basically taking uh, a Fisher Price dollhouse and turn it into my dream haunted house playset. Um, as well as we're going to be talking about creepy toys, haunted house toys, and stuff like that. You may get a few repeats from this channel, only because I mean, Frankenstein's awesome. So we'll talk about some of that stuff. But um, but for the most part, it's going to be more larger set toys and stuff like that. And, and hopefully, 
it'll be more of a kind of like what Pixel Dan does with the, the more recent stuff that comes out. Uh, Ready Sets is supposed to be coming out with a creepy play set. And I've already been in talks with them, and I'm hoping to get a... Uh, uh, what is it called? Please don't tell me that was my last life. It was, wasn't it? You motherfuckers. Um, as far as that's concerned, and hoping to get a... Uh, they called it something else. It's not a demo model. Um, I think they called it a prototype. <laughs> A prototype review model or something like that. But I've talked to them and they're, they're willing to do that. I just have to... It was supposed to be out this past October. And I don't know what's going on, but I've been keeping my ear to the ground. I have their email still. And they're like, when you see that, there's a pre-order on it. Let us know and we'll get you one. So I'm really excited to get that and and, and, and share it on that channel. So I'll put a link to that down below. Uh, I think it already is in my normal notes, but I'll also put a bubble to it at the end of this. And it's, it's just going to be that, but it's going to be a lot more family-friendly than the Atari Creep. Um, the Haunted House playset YouTube channel. We're going to create something amazing, and we're going to look at some really cool, I guess you would almost call it like a Halloween-style channel, you know? But regardless, all my creep, my actual creep is going to go over there. So I suppose that's really it. Let me look at my notes here real quick after killing this fucking guy. Um, many new subs. We talked about that. The cool stuff coming out. ECS and the Amico. Hopefully I touched on that enough. Uh, project slowing down. Yep, I already talked about that. I made this list three days ago because this was going to be a, a pre, pre New Year's kind of video, but I chose not to. But then I decided to go back into it. You see what I mean about feel? It's all about feel. You guys couldn't even imagine, imagine the amount of videos that never get made. Really cool videos. That I get the excitement for, some might even start. And then I just delete it, and they're gone forever. Alright. Uh, getting back to chats, 1,000 soon. So let's talk about 1,000 subs before I sign off, anyway. Am I going to do anything big for it? I don't think so. I think I'm going to thank you guys a lot, maybe try to find all of your addresses and come give you a hug. Uh, if that's okay with you, if you're not really into that, the, the proximity thing, that, that's fine. Um, please let me know, and I'll just I'll just do this one. I see you at the door. Um, but I have a little box I've been putting together. Um, I've just got nothing crazy. It's a couple of commentary cards, some toys, uh, some creep it real stickers, uh, a few leftover dust sleeves for video game dust sleeves. Was generous enough to uh, do the Alzheimer's stuff for me, and, um, oh, fuck you, we're going to get 10,000 today, whether it's on camera or not, it's happening, um, but I, I do plan on doing a giveaway, uh, with that box, it's not the biggest box in the world, but it's just something to say thank you, um, I do have a t-shirt shop, uh, maybe I'll buy myself a couple t-shirts and put them in there, uh, or, or you can just give me your address and I'll just drop ship it to you. You tell me what size and which one you want. I don't know. We'll do something. But I'm like 75 away from it. 75. And my birthday's in March. I don't think it's unrealistic to be well into the thousand by March. I was kind of aiming for March. But at this rate, I don't think it's going to be unrealistic to hit it pretty soon. Look at that. Two kills at once. The like Ted Bundy shit right there. Walk around the sorority house and fucking go nuts. I mean, no disrespect to the victims, by the way. I just meant the veracity. The veracity and the volume of carnage. That guy is a sick fuck. But that's it, guys. So, again, I hope you had a great New Year's Eve. Hope you were safe and you're not in a fucking hospital somewhere. The fucking tubes in your throat because you're an idiot had too much to drink, or you smoked too much whatever, or you chewed it up too much, and you decided to drive your car through a fucking limousine full of old people. Fuck you if you did that. I don't want you here. But if you didn't do that, thank you for being here. I really do appreciate it. Go ahead and leave your thoughts down below. What is your favorite part of my channel? Um, I'm really interested. What is it that brings you here? Is it the gameplay? Is it my filthy mouth? Do you just think I'm sexy? Do you like the toys? You like the coverage? Oh, man. When the VCS and the Amico go away, as far as, you know, breaking news kind of stuff, 
Uh, I'd be curious to see how many of you guys are still here. And if you leave, you leave. It's fine with me. If you're not seeing something you like, I'm not going to try to force you to stick around. I'd hate for anyone to fucking stick around in a situation they hated. But let me know down in the comments below, what is your favorite part? What do you want me to focus on in 2020? And I'll try to oblige, I suppose. Like I said, it's about feel. Um, if there's something I don't do, um, let me know. I don't really do pickup videos because I don't do pickups. I don't go out hunting anymore. It's, it's kind of pointless where I live right now. I'll find the occasional thing, but and then I'll just make a video about that one thing. So I'll do a pickup video. It's kind of not out of the question, but it's just not realistic right now in this, this point of collecting, collecting them, collecting hood. Yeah, let me know down in the comments below what you think. What's your favorite part? What would you like to see more of? What would you like to see less of? And uh, leave your feedback. Thumbs up, thumbs down. <coughs> it's always positive to me, guys. Until next time, thank you always so much for watching. Again, I can't say that enough. Creep it real. Bye-bye.